So, you're interested in NFTs, but now find yourself wondering how they generate value. The answer is not as complex as it seems. We've already described what an NFT is. Now it's time to explore how they create value for everyone, whether you're in blockchain or not. First, let's get technical. Like cryptocurrencies, NFTs are tokens that live on the blockchain. While each coin of a cryptocurrency is exactly alike, NFTs are completely unique. Each time an artist, musician, or other creator mints an NFT, they turn their artwork, song, game, or other media into a virtual asset. Thanks to cryptographic code, the asset's identifying information can never be changed or tampered with. Think digital provenance. In other words, we'll always know where it came from. Next, to add value, scarcity. As a digital asset, an NFT is issued as a limited edition either in a quantity of one or as many non-fungible tokens as the creator chooses to mint. By minting only one, a dozen, or even a few hundred NFTs, a maker creates scarcity through exclusivity. This limited supply, along with other factors like the work's aesthetic desirability or the creator's artistic skill, enhances the demand for the NFT and, consequently, its overall value. And here's where it gets interesting. Unlike the traditional art world, Creators can also include exclusive content or other digital collectibles within their NFTs. An audio NFT could come with exclusive artwork, an invitation to a virtual social club, or even a physical collectible. A recording artist or label could, for example, offer an audio NFT that includes an ultra-exclusive vinyl single. It boils down to this, in any market, it's only worth as much as someone is willing to pay. As in traditional markets like real estate, trading cards, and used instrument sales, to name a few, the value of any NFT hinges on you and me, the market. Many buyers are fans and they simply want to support the creator via NFTs. Others increasingly see it as an investment bet. If an artist is famous and or talented, then wealthy art collectors, or any collector for that matter, might speculate that an artist's NFTs will rise in value over time and therefore be willing to pay more for them in the short term. Oh, and there's one more thing. Before you jump into the exciting world of NFTs because you think the price is only going to go up, well, none of this much matters if an NFT's underlying cryptocurrency isn't stable. When creators sell an NFT, they get paid in crypto. In return, the buyer gets to deposit the NFT in their crypto wallet where it maintains its value. On a fundamental level, this stable exchange of virtual goods and tokens is crucial in the minting and buying of NFTs. Think about it. If a cryptocurrency's price continually fluctuates, an NFT's value would also rise and fall. Something to factor in if you see your NFT purchase as an investment. So, is it all hype, or are NFTs a real thing? Well, as more and more industries like fashion, news media, publishing, and markets embrace NFTs and the wider blockchain ecosystem, this will further stabilize cryptocurrencies by acting as a counterbalance to token speculation. And NFTs have applications beyond art, and many other industries are just starting to explore this today. Which means NFTs have a solid chance of maintaining and building value for Web3's new creative economy and beyond.